I think the only way that a co-location only provider can succeed without cloud is that they have a kind of a unique play on the co-location side. For instance, in Equinix, with their, uh, their uh, high interconnectivity to cloud providers, the telex assets, the digital loans uh, that have uh, real points of presence in, in certain markets and really th that interconnection, uh, even um, some of the, the edge play that a few of the providers are doing. But there's really an angle to those, those co-location providers that, that um, helps them grow in conjunction with the growth in cloud. Uh, however, in secondary and tertiary markets where, where TierPoint primarily operates, you really aren't going to be able to survive and grow if you don't have that full hybrid uh, solution suite of, of IT services. Um, customers are really coming to us for, uh, for more and more solutions. It started as a trusted advisor for just co-location, and now it's moved into, into those, uh, those customers wanting us to take them to the cloud, to help them understand what it means to, to operate in a virtual environment, whether that's private cloud or hyperscale cloud like AWS or Azure. we'll be rolling out a managed Azure product across the entire country. So what that does is it allows customers to, uh, to deploy co-location in our, in, our, uh, in our data centers, to deploy private cloud within the, the, the tier point cloud, but then also to, uh, to roll um, uh, workloads and certain environments into Azure. We'll help them manage those environments, We'll give them a single pane of glass so they can actually be, you know, view and, uh, and move the workloads between Azure and, uh, and their private cloud environment within TierPoint. And then by year end, we'll have a proof of concept around managed AWS as well. So uh, we've really sped up the investment in, in Azure and AWS, uh, whereas before we were focused on, on Direct Connect and Express Route so that customers could, could connect to those clouds. And now we're investing a lot of dollars in helping our customers actually manage workloads and manage environments uh, on those different platforms. The growth in cloud is affecting us uh, in, in that we're having to speed up investment into areas that we weren't planning to just, just two years ago. So while the DNA of TierPoint really is in managed services and in, in managing physical environments that, that turn into managing virtual environments within a private cloud, uh, we've seen increasing demand from our customers for, for managed AWS and managed Azure. So where we were focused a year ago, uh, and, and still today, it was on getting connectivity into those clouds uh, through Express Route for Azure or uh, Direct Connect with AWS but we're having to shift more dollars into focusing on being able to actually manage environments in those hyperscale clouds. We really expect to see a variation of deployments where workloads end up in the environment where they're really best suited. So there are certain applications that really should stay within co-location. Uh, on the private cloud side, whether it's because of performance or cost or security, uh, there are many environments and workloads that really should be in a private cloud. And then you're seeing, um, understandably, seeing growth on the, the hyperscale side. So we really see a world where, where co-location, private cloud, and the hyperscalers all work together, and that our end users are coming to a company like TierPoint to, to help manage them uh, and manage those workloads flexibly across all three environments. The advances that uh, in data center design and efficiency that the internet giants are making um, do trickle down and benefit co-location providers. The difference is that they have the luxury of being able to design data centers and they can lay out every single rack, how it's going to be, the, the exact power configuration. Whereas in co-location, we need to provide our customers with a lot of flexibility. So TierPoint's real differentiator is our people and the fact that we're local. Uh, our customers are coming to us really with their critical IT infrastructure. They need a partner that's going to help them understand and navigate all of the changing technology. And TierPoint's approach, which is really a very consultative sales approach, uh, a long-term lifecycle management for that customer, uh, is a real key differentiator for us. So Schneider's been, been a great partner of ours uh, for years now. Everything from design build opportunities to, to using and leveraging structure wear to understanding changes in the industry. And uh, one great example is our data center build in Seattle. We had 90 days for a real critical customer. We had to have, really move heaven and earth to, to have it built. Uh, the Schneider team led everything from design build standpoint, from a project management standpoint, 
worked hand in hand with the TierPoint team. We delivered on time, on budget, and it was a great success story for us, both of us. Thank you.